This is Catholic Daily Reflections for Friday of the 26th week in Ordinary Time. Today's reflection is entitled, Instruments of God. Whoever listens to you listens to me. Whoever rejects you rejects me. And whoever rejects me rejects the one who sent me. Jesus makes a threefold connection in this passage. He connects you to him and himself to the Father. Thus, when you are acting as a true instrument of the Lord, and another either listens to or rejects what you bring to them, they are either listening to or rejecting not only you, but also our Lord and the Father in heaven. One thing this reveals is the awesome responsibility we all have to bring the love and mercy of the Father in heaven to those whom we encounter every day. We are able to be true instruments of God. In making such a strong connection between us, himself, and the Father in heaven, Jesus is elevating our human dignity to an incredible level. This passage also reveals the fact that others will act as instruments of God to us. This is important to understand because Jesus is very clear. If someone comes to us, acts in Christ's name, and we reject that person, then we are actually rejecting the Father in heaven. This should lead us to pause and be seriously attentive to the way in which we treat others. We must especially be aware of the fact that others have great potential to be instruments of God to us. The Lord speaks through them in numerous ways. Reflect today upon these revelations. Reflect upon the great gift it is to act as an instrument of the Father in heaven. This is a sacred duty and a profound privilege we must not take lightly. Look also for ways that the Father speaks to you through others. When He speaks, give Him your full attention and be grateful for those who act as these instruments of God's love. Let us pray. Lord, I thank You for the honor and privilege of serving as an instrument of Your holy voice. May I always seek to embrace this calling with faith and sincerity. May I also be open to every way that you speak to me through others. Give me the humility I need to listen to your voice through them. Jesus, I trust in you.